State of Idaho versus Brian Koberger. The quadruple murder trial of Brian Koberger now has a new courtroom and a new judge. The Idaho Supreme Court selecting Boise as the new location for trial next summer. Koberger has spent nearly two years in the Lataw County Jail after being charged with the murders of four University of Idaho students, Madison Mogan, Kaylee Gonzalez, Zana Kernodal, and Ethan Chapin. A judge entered a not guilty plea on his behalf. Now he'll be moved 300 miles south to Ada County, which has a much larger jury pool. The state Supreme Court selecting Boise as the new trial location after a Lataw County judge found the media frenzy over the case tainted potential jurors' views of Koberger, and logistical and safety concerns were too great for the small community to handle. The Ada County Courthouse is uh, many volumes larger than the Lataw County Courthouse, and we just completed having uh, two venue change sensational murder trials. So the administrative judge has established a significant protocol for how to handle the cameras, the security, the public. The Honorable Stephen Hippler on the bench for more than a decade will now preside over the Koberger trial. Judge Hippler has a strong personality. Uh, he's an intelligent man. Uh, he is uh, very inclined to keep control of his courtroom. Hippler describing the preparations for other high-profile trials of Lori Vallow and Chad Daybell in Boise last year. We have big trials here that, all the time. The parents and Kaylee Gonzalez praising the appointment of a new judge in the case. Find a man that's got some character and some leadership and let's hit the ground and let's go. The Gonzalez family wanted, of course, the child to stay in Lataw County there, but now say in a statement in part, quote, we are confident the physical location of the trial will make no difference in the end. We know Ada County is more than capable and more experienced to help us achieve justice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's a big move. The big yeah. decision's been made. So what happens next? Yeah, so now Brian Koberg will actually be physically transferred. We don't have a date for that transfer. They like to keep it under wraps for security reasons, but he will actually physically now move down to Ada County. And then the judge, Judge Hippler there, is going to bring everything everybody in probably for a scheduling conference because of course the family wants to make sure that date sticks but he's got to get up to speed and he's still got to decide all these pending motions including one on the death penalty but guys he did the last big death penalty case this judge, in that state, huh? this judge so he has the experience did you say that will the prosecution team stay the same so we've asked that and as of right now we're told that they are going to stay the same but we have been had a lot of questions on that given all the other changes here all mm -hmm. right yeah. Laura, keep us posted yeah. thank you oh. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.